diffusion of A through non-diffusing B. Diffusion is a movement of molecules from higher concentration to lower concentration. For example, if we spray perfume at one end in a room, it will be diffused to the other end. The perfume spray uh, sprayed at one end is higher concentration and it is diffused to other end that is lower concentration. Let we let's move on to the problem. Oxygen is diffusing in a mixture of oxygen nitrogen at 1 atm 25 degree celsius concentration of oxygen at planes 2 mm apart are 10 and 20 volume percentage respectively nitrogen is non diffusing derive the appropriate expression to calculate the flux of oxygen and calculate the flux of oxygen. Diffusivity of oxygen in nitrogen is 1.89 into 10 power minus 5 meter square per second. The given data here is pressure is equal to 1 atm, temperature is equal to 25 degree celsius and Volume percentage are 10 and 20. Nitrogen is non-diffusing here. And we have to find the derivation to calculate the flux of oxygen. And we have to apply this value to find flux of oxygen. In this condition, we take oxygen as component A and nitrogen as component B. Here oxygen is diffusing and nitrogen is non-diffusing. To start the derivation, Na is equal to Nxa plus Ja where Na is flux of oxygen of A component that is oxygen is N into Xa that is total flux into mole fraction where Na is the mass transfer between stagnant and bulk flow. To find the particular for particular component here in this question they have given the oxygen nitrogen are combined. So to find particularly we have to find total flux and mole fraction plus JA. JA is mass transfer at particular point. By fixed law that is flux is directly proportional to concentration gradient. JA is flux. DAB is diffusivity or diffusion coefficient. DCA by DZ is concentration gradient. We know that total flux is the combination of these two components that is oxygen and nitrogen. So NA is flux of oxygen and NB is flux of nitrogen. XA is mole fraction. To find mole fraction, we know that mole fraction is equal to mole by total mole. Here Xa is mole fraction of oxygen. So mole of oxygen divided by total mole that is mole of oxygen and mole of nitrogen. We know that Concentration is equal to, it's a ratio of mole by volume. To find concentration of oxygen, mole of oxygen and volume is constant. So, rearrange this equation. Na is equal to Ca into V. And for N, 
n is equal to c into v. Then substitute in x a. We get x a is equal to n a by n that is c a that is c a v by c into v v v cancel. I uh, by substituting uh, c a by c in terms of n a by n then mole fraction is equal to c a by c. Then J is equation 2 and these are the equation 3. Substitute 2 and 3 in equation 1. We get Na is equal to N that is Na plus Nb into Xa that is Ca by C. Then Ja that is minus Dab Dca by dz. Take it as equation 4. By rearranging equation 4, we get first take LCM of C, then it becomes whole, then multiply to the left hand side, then the equation becomes dz by C dab is equal to minus dca by nac minus naca minus nbca here we know that the nitrogen is component b that is non diffusing so nb is equal to 0 the term becomes 0 by integrating the rearranged equation that is equation 5 we get Integration of dz is z. By integrating dz from 0 to z, the, it becomes z by c dab. Then on the right hand side, dca by nac minus naca. As na is common, take it outside. Then integrate the Equation that is integration of CA1 to CA2 that is from initial to final DCA by C minus CA. Here we have to integrate with respect to CA. So we know that integration of 1 by x into dx is equal to ln ln x. So, by integrating we get ln c minus c a into minus 1. Okay. Minus ln c minus c a. The limit is c a 1 c a 2. By applying the limit, the equation becomes already we have minus in the equation. So, this minus and the minus cancel. Then, by applying the limit, ln C minus CA2 minus ln C minus C A 1. We know that ln A minus ln B is equal to ln A by B. So, apply this formula ln ln C minus C A 2 that is A by C minus C A 1. Substitute this value in the equation, substitute this value in this equation, then it becomes, we need flux of oxygen. So, rearrange this equation, take this Na to the left hand side and 
the equation becomes n a is equal to d a b c by z ln c minus c a 2 divided by c minus c a 1. In our question, pressure value is given. So, we have to convert this concentration formula in terms of pressure. For that, we know that P, V is equal to N, R, T, where C is equal to N by V. Concentration is a ratio of mole by volume. Then C is equal to P by R T. Substitute for concentration in this equation. Then we get N A is equal to D A B P T by R T Z. Then substitute for this concentration P by R T for C A 2 P A 2 by R T as in numerator and denominator it, uh, R T is present. So cancel both R T. Then equation becomes ln P T minus P A 2 divided by Pt minus Pa1. This is the final equation for flux of oxygen. Before substituting the value, we have to check whether all the unit are same for the value. As pressure value is atm, it's okay. Then temperature is in degree Celsius. So, convert temperature of degree Celsius to Kelvin. To convert degree Celsius to Kelvin plus 273. Then DAB that is diffusivity unit is in meter square. So, convert Z unit also in meter. To convert 1 millimeter to meter into 10 power minus 3. Then after converting these value, check here for PA1 and PA2, the value is in volume percentage. We know that volume percentage is equal to pressure percentage is equal to mole percentage. So take the value of this as these are equal. So 20 divided by 100 to convert percentage to value. So it becomes 0 0.2. And for 10, it becomes 0 0.1. Why we took PA1 as 20? Because it converts from higher concentration to lower concentration to initial. So, initial is PA1 that is 20 and final is 10 low concentration. Substitute this value in the formula. DAB this 1.89 into 10 power minus 5. Total pressure 1 atm and T 298 and Z 0 0.002. For universal gas constant or value, we have to check all the unit in the given question. According to that, we have to select R value. So, as the unit given here is atm. So, 0 0.082 in, uh, atm meter cube per kilo mole dot kelvin. Substitute or value. Then, ln Pt, total pressure is 1 minus Pa2. Pa2 is 0 0.1. So, 0 0.1. Divided by 1 minus Pa1 is 0 0.2. By solving this, we get 4.5 into 10 power minus 5.
kilomole per meter square second. For checking the unit for the given question, substitute all the unit and cancel it. We get kilomole per meter square second. We have found the derivation for flux of oxygen and the value for flux of oxygen. Thank you.